Welcome to Science with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to go through some important words when it comes to ecosystems. Now these words are great to know when both learning and talking about ecosystems. So maybe you're here for a review, or maybe you're here for an introduction. Either way, I hope this video helps. And just so you know, these aren't the only words you need to know when it comes to ecosystems, but it's a great start. Now this is part one. I will also have a part two. I'll drop that link down in the description. So let's get started here. And we start off with ecosystem. And an ecosystem is made up of all the living and non-living factors within a given area, and it's all of their interactions. Now ecosystems can be small, like a puddle, or large, like a rainforest. There's no specific size requirement. For number two, we have habitat. Basically, a habitat is a place where an organism lives. A habitat provides an organism food, water, shelter, and meets all of the needs of that specific organism. Think of it like an organism's home. There are many different types of habitats, but a few examples include a river, a coral reef, a rainforest, or a desert. For number three, we have biotic. Biotic factors of ecosystems are living things or once were living things, so plants, animals, bacteria, etc. Abiotic factors are non-living factors within an ecosystem. Examples include water and sunlight. Next, we have limiting factor. A limiting factor is anything that controls a population's size or slows or even stops that population from growing. For example, food and space are limiting factors. The amount of food in a given area will limit the population that eats that food. As far as space, for example, the space in a pond will limit how many fish can live in that pond. And lastly, we have niche, or you'll sometimes hear pronounced niche. A niche is a role or job that an organism has. This is how an organism fits into an ecosystem. So a lion fills the role of an apex predator within its ecosystem. All parts of an organism's life is a part of its niche. So an organism's interactions within the ecosystem, its habitat, what it eats, what may eat it, etc. Everything about that organism and how it fits into its role within an ecosystem is its niche. So there you have it. There are some important vocabulary words and words to know when it comes to ecosystems. I'll drop the link to part two down in the description. I hope to see you over there and I hope this video helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.